Hey, hey, Leonard. Good evening, my friend. Oh, that guy was tearing me up. I didn't realize he could do that much damage. Get out of here, fish guy. All right. We're going over here. Ah, uh, I need to make a drill out of the hallowed metal, huh? Yeah, that's about right. Not there yet. All right, we're dropping down, people. We're going all the way. We're sending our love down the well. Is that one? Let me see. It looks like something. Yep, jungle spores. Got three right there. Okay, cool. Now I know what they look like. All right. Um, let's look for some more. Let's just get like a thousand more of them. That could be a jungle temple. That looks like something. Or that, that's just like a jungle house. Like a creepy magic house. There's one of those turtles that I'm not a fan of. Get out of here, turtle guy. You're not welcome in your own biome. There's a bunch of jungle spores right there. Now we're talking. Nosh says I need 12. Okay, Nosh, thank you, my friend. We're going for it. Get them. All right, well, how many we got? We got 11. You might be right. I'm going to get, like, more than enough. Uh, hey, look at this. Life fruit permanently increases max life by 5. Does this work if you're already at 400? It says get a life. Hey, it did work. Look at that. It, My heart, like, filled in more. Cool. It changed color. I always love that in games when, like, the enemy's life bar, you know, like, had different colors that you would have to work through. Those are the hard mode life crystals. Oh, okay, thank you. Cool. Well, again, it's just all stuff that we need to do. Um, this is called the Strong Staff of Regrowth. Hey, dude, stop trying to get me. I'm looking in the chest. It says, increases alchemy plant... Dude, get away from me. I'm trying to open the treasure chest. It says, increases alchemy plant... Oh, this is nice. Cool. All right, what else do we want? Featherfall, gold coins, of course. Um, Jester zero, throwing knife. That's ah, all right. We're good on everything else. Well, there's no reason to not take the torches, I guess. All right, sweet. All right, let's find some more spores. So if I'm, like, picking flowers or herbs, I just get more if I have that staff. That's cool. No, that's another thing, Nosh, that I need to do. My, um... My farm is terrible. I need to get more seeds. I really need to plant better. Um, armored band of regeneration. Gravitation potion. Gold coin. Now that's a great item. Yep, so it's just about exploring, getting more items, and trying to get more comfortable with the game so I can handle some of this stuff without being so sad that I get wrecked by things in hard mode. Alright. Let's keep looking for those spores. Mm -hmm -hmm. Oh, here's a haunted little house down here. Let's go for it. Ghost house. That staff will replace my axe? Interesting. You mean after I upgraded or right now? There's bees everywhere. Oh my goodness. It's just a... Bees. Upgraded. Okay, cool. Love it. Love to hear it. Right, what do we got? We got 
a hasty cloud in a bottle. What is my cloud in a bottle? It's just the hard cloud in a bottle. So this is, you know, pretty much the same thing. Could be better. I don't know if you need an extra one of these. Um, but I could take it just to have another one. Maybe you use it for crafting or something. There's the spores right there. Look at that. How about it? What boots do I currently have on? Let me show you, my friend. I am currently wearing the uh, Menacing Frost Spark boots. Oh, she wants to show me something, huh? What you got, fairy? What, this treasure chest right here? I already opened it. That's too bad. Alright, um... How many do I have? I have 13 spores. I need more spores. Yeah, it's uh, kind of a lazy fairy. You're like, come on, man. Oh, I see. I have to pick up the chest. And then that would have made it so that fairy wouldn't have gone there. But I just take the items I want and leave the chest behind which is bad practice for fairies. I gotcha. All right, and here's some spores. Got two more. I think we're there. Oh, here's even more. So let's just get all these and... Oh, here's another one of these life crystal things. So... Can you guys tell me... Um, you know, I'm going around here and... Uh, I'm just finding these life fruits. Do they just drop only in the jungle or do they drop other places? Because it seems like if they drop in the jungle, I should just stay here for a while and get a bunch to fill up my entire health bar. I don't know how you guys feel about that, but it seems like it could be a big difference maker. I'm getting some jungle spores going. Only in the jungle. Welcome to the jungle. It, and again, I could be wrong, but it looks like almost enemy can, any enemy could potentially drop it. Right, I'm going to get some more spores and stuff just in case. Is this where you also get day bloom or are those only found outside? Oh, they're not a drop. They grow. Oh, okay. Thank you. So I don't need to just kill enemies. It's true, Alex. I am the one playing. But I also realized, like, I have really bad ideas um, in terms of, of time efficiency or prioritization sometimes. So I'm just kind of running it by you to see how worthwhile it seems to you. All right, I'm going to just keep going down. Do the life crystals show up on the map at all? Or the flowers or whatever you want to call them? Life fruit, I guess is what they're called. Use a spelunker potion. Oh, I see. Hey, Wizard Ike. What is up, my friend? Good evening. Good to see you again. Thanks for raiding again, my friend. How you doing? All right, we're going in. Now, well, there's definitely some of those uh, spores up there. That makes sense, Nosh. Okay, yeah, I don't think I have any spelunkers with me, but... Oh, gosh, I'm going to drown myself in honey. It could be worse things. It's like death by honey. for some spores. Wizard Ike, it's going well, my friend. I'm in hard mode, um, and I'm trying to get a little bit stronger, power myself up. This is my first time in Terrarius. Um, 
in terms of my playthrough, so I don't know, like, all of the tricks that everybody else knows, so I'm just kind of going along and exploring and trying to figure things out. Terraria is one of those games where I just had no idea how deep of a rabbit hole it really was. What is this over here? What is this wall? Is this the temple? Looks like it. Now, I'm sh I'm betting I can't dig through this, right? Like, I need to go to up to the top to find a doorway, maybe? Do I have Star Fury? I do, Nosh. I have two Star Furies, but they're back at the base. I used an explosive there. You need to fight a boss, um... To, to get a key. Oh, I see. So I can't really get inside until I defeat the boss. Okay. Well, I'll just keep collecting spores, looking for life fruits to chomp down on. All right. I have enough now, though, to just go make my replacement. Okay. So this looks like the top of it, right here. Okay. Alright, so we're good then. So now I've learned about life fruit, and um, I've got enough stuff to make the... Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just sort my stuff away. And now all I need would be my... Uh, I can just craft it right here. So all we need is the blade of grass. And make it. Great. And then if I have um, these, can I now make um, Knight's Edge? I don't even know what Duke Fishron is. Um, let's see. So I have... Oh, I need an altar to make it, huh? Are those the same altars that I break with my hammer to make war spawn or is that a different kind of altar okay thank you all right well touche then we've got plenty of those things left okay let me put some of this stuff away i'll put these um moon glow seeds jungle spores um my staff of regrowth will go in with my potions just in case Oh, that's cool, Nosh. All right. Um. Ding, ding. Uh huh. And uh. Ding, ding. There we go. All right. Let's go find ourselves an altar. Um, they're usually visible pretty easily on the map. I'm just gonna try to find the closest one. I think I just passed one, honestly, when I went down the tree. There's definitely some... ...where I was in the dungeon. There's also some... Um, oh, you know what? You guys said we needed ichor, so might as well go to an evil biome and go down below to find ichor. So here's a bunch of altars over in this evil biome. And then, did you guys also say that in the evil biome, don't I need to get some kind of essence in the evil biome for the destroyer or one of those bosses too? Um, is it soul of night or whatever? So let's go get soul of night and let's get the altar to make 
the Knight's Edge, and then also look for Icker. They're called Icker Sticklers, but it has to be really deep. Okay, so the only deep, deep evil biome that I have found is um, was down here, where I lost my Knight's Edge in the first place in the lava, I believe. Something like this area. I see. Thank you. Okay. Well. I have an idea. I have a great idea. Genius idea. Genius level idea. Here it comes. I'm going to go down my elevator and I'm going to try to dig right over. Yes, that's what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to try to make a connection between my elevator. Let me see the map. I'm going to start digging to the left right about uh, I don't want to be in the lava, so maybe over here. Oh boy. And see if this will help me. All right, here we go. Do 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 do. All right, Pearl Stone. We can also look for altars. All right, great. How to die with sand. Or it's silk, I guess we'll call it. Oh. Hi. Good to see ya. Oh boy, pink water. You know, the pink water is always a little questionable. You're not sure what you got going on here. So how many of you guys have dug through every square of the map so there's no dirt left, there's no rocks, there's nothing. It's just empty space. I know you've attempted it. I guess you could use like dynamite and stuff. Make it faster. This looks like a previous elevator that I tried to make. That was smart of me. It makes a water world. Oh, you're right. The oceans just fill the whole thing in. That's funny. I didn't think about it like that. I could set down train tracks everywhere and just make my own little rail system. Here it comes. Look at that. I made my own bridge. That's Engineering 101 right there. I'm standing on a cactus. That's just asking for trouble. Can't stand on that. All right, so we're in the desert underground. Okay. Not bad. Need to go deeper, though, to get where we want to go. Oh, look at that wild background. Alright. 
Okay, so this looks like an evil biome, right? Now, I don't know if it's deep enough, though. So we're going to start looking for the... the ichor. And... also... Oh, here's that ghost lady. Hi, ghost lady. Cave bats. Eat your heart out. There it is. So we got the, uh... Oh, do I not have space in my inventory? Right. Here, just throw that away. Throw this away. Soul of Night. There it is. Gnaw shall be strewn for at least another hour, my friend. Probably another hour and 20 minutes. All right. I'm going to keep going over here. We're going to obviously be looking for Icker, looking for altars, looking for everything. Now, this isn't an altar. This is just like Crimtain or some kind of ore. Okay, Nosh. Take care, my friend. All right. And my poor inventory. Altars don't spawn at this level. Oh, because I'm too deep. I see what you mean. Well, no worries. We'll look for the ichor and the souls. Oh, there's like a big... There it is, the Icker guy. There he is. Icker man. He's gross looking. He's like a big octopus full of fluid. I've been put off my meal. Alright. He didn't have to look like that. They could have they could have made him look different. That's gross. Um Alright, we got Icker. So we now have um For Icar, the blood of the gods. Let's get some more Icar. I knew that was going to happen. Why would I not know? But the important thing is... I made an easy path back to my body. <laughs> I know, Alex. Isn't it hilarious? I open those exploding chests every time. And do you know why they work on me every time? Because I love treasure chests. I just can't get enough. All right, no problem. I know, me boy, I forgot about the wiring. I could even see the wiring and it still didn't help me. That's how embarrassing it is. All right. Oh, looks like I already must have had some ichor. So it went down into another chest. Let's see, Icar, where did you go? You disgusting Icar, you. Do 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 do. Um, I know it went somewhere. That's not very descriptive, but it. It's in my base. There's Icar somewhere in my base. We'll find it. Mm -hmm. I know, Blackthorn. It's like, I want the shiny so bad, I just can't see that there could be any danger for me. Bam. It's over. All right. Um, where would I have put it? In potions? Why hast thou forsaken me, Icar? I know you flew into a chest somewhere. I just... Oh, here it is, right here. I have 14. Okay, so the imbuing station. Let's figure out where I put that. It's not that thing, I don't... Is it? What is this thing? Is this... I don't even know what station this is. Um, 
crafting solidifier. Thank you. All right. I, I've got the imbuing thing somewhere, but I don't know where. Looks like I have two solidifiers built. That's problematic. Makes slime furniture, you say. Here it is. Okay, great. Um, so on this thing, if I want to make the ichor, you said I need an empty vial and some water and ichor? Let's talk to the... Uh, does the guide know the recipe? Let's find out. Hey, dude. Do you know if I use this, what am I going to make? Okay, water and ichor makes a flask of ichor. I see. Okay, great. Oh, and you know what? This is a tip from Jen that I need to follow up on. I need to get some buckets. So let's see. If I just take iron, can I craft a bucket? This is a bucket. Okay, yeah, I can. So I need to make two empty buckets. And I'm going to make a watering hole inside my base. So I think... Jen was saying I just have to dig like one hole and then put water in it and then with the buckets and then I can fill up my flasks there forever is it like that if I just put water on that tile all right let's go Oh, it looks like I have water right down here anyway. Aw, Alex, it's it's okay. It's a good joke. It's fun. All right, here we go. I guess I have water here. But what I can do is I'm going to just do this experiment for fast purposes. I'm going to put this up here. And then I'm just going to say nine. And then I fill them up. Great. And then now... Oh, boy. Okay. And then now I have water buckets, and I just need to pour them out. Okay. And so now I have a little thing of water right there, and then I can just go... If I have glass bottles... Um, I actually don't know if I have enough of those. I might need to make more. But then again, I need to make a ton of potions anyway, right? All right, let's go into potions. And I only have seven bottles. So I think that's with sand that you make that. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I have sand blocks. I don't know if that's good enough. I can make star in a bottle. Um, that's not really what I'm going for. I need to make glass bottles. Maybe I make glass first. And then I go and I can make bottles. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay, great. So I just need to make more glass. So let's make a ton of glass like this. Oh, that's cool, Alex. Is there a way, is it like shift-click to just craft all that you could possibly craft with the amount of ingredients that you have? Or is that not a thing? 